USCIS celebrates Independence Day 2023 and continues its commitment to naturalization. 5,500 new citizens in more than 180 naturalization ceremonies between June 30th and July 7th. We make daily U.S. immigration update videos to make your U.S. journey easy. Make sure to subscribe to this channel and like the video. Let's get into the video. USCIS will celebrate Independence Day this year by welcoming more than 5,500 new citizens in more than 180 naturalization ceremonies between June 30th and July 7th. USCIS welcomed 974,000 new U.S. citizens so far in FY 2023. USCIS has welcomed 588,900 new U.S. citizens as of June 7th and made significant progress in reducing our naturalization pending queues. Making the naturalization process accessible to all who are eligible are a beautiful extension of many ideals that birthed our nation 247 years ago. Said USCIS Director Ur M. Jadu. This year's holiday is a very special opportunity to reaffirm our commitment to the USCIS mission and to welcome new citizens as they begin their American journey. Every July 4, USCIS celebrates the day the Second Continental Congress adopted the Declaration of Independence in 1776. Declaring that the 13 American colonies regarded themselves as a new nation, the United States of America, and were no longer part of the British Empire. USCIS commemorates this momentous occasion by hosting special Independence Day themed naturalization ceremonies across the country. Throughout these ceremonies, USCIS will honor and recognize the commitment and contributions of our newest U.S. citizens. This year USCIS is highlighting the importance of civics and citizenship with a series of events. Civic season began with a special ceremony on World Refugee Day and will end with the fiscal year 2023. Citizenship and Integration Grants Award Announcement This year's Independence Day activities will include special naturalization ceremonies across the country including close to our nation's capital at George Washington's Mount Vernon and Thomas Jefferson's Monticello in Virginia, and the Museum of the American Revolution in Philadelphia. USCIS reaffirms our commitment to making the naturalization process accessible to all who are eligible. Since the beginning of the Biden-Harris administration, USCIS has taken a number of steps to support the implementation of Executive Order 14012. Restoring faith in our legal immigration system, and strengthening integration and inclusion efforts for new Americans. After each naturalization ceremony, USCIS encourages new U.S. citizens to share their naturalization stories. And photos on social media using the hashtag, hashtag new U.S. citizen. Thanks for watching.